race of the day. Stand by, and they're off and racing. The uh, very heavily fancied Hatamat Al Khaladia got away well in the red and black colours. The grey filly there towards the right of shot as we look at them. Also prominent is Mabubat Jude in the predominantly green colours. They're then followed by Moga in the white and red, and then after that the checked sleeves of Michal Al Kateab. They're then followed rather wide by Muna, who's going to take the turn three horses uh, wide. Then after that, uh, the nine horse, that's Afsa Moom, who's racing in around about sixth spot at the moment as they take the turn, a pretty well grouped up fashion. They're then followed by Hamdi, the Qatari bred, followed then by Lahab, and then right at the rear of the field is Labid al Khaladia. So they're making the turn. They'll be going down the far side very shortly and going inside the final 1,200 metres. And as they do so, it's Hatamat al Khaladia that's out in front. To in second position, Mabubat Jude. Then towards the outer in third, Mishal El Kateb, who, as I said, has been a little bit wide in the run, even wider still. Mooner in the orange cap, jockey trying to get back in there, Khalid Al Mamoni, to get a slightly more economical run nearer the rail. They're then followed by Samoom, followed then right up the inside by Fala Judah. Then after that, the white and red of Moga, followed then towards the outer uh, by uh, the blue colours of Hamdi, who's still a little bit back in the run, as indeed is Samoom. Then after that, Lahab, who's last but one, and still at the rear of the field, is Labid Al Khaladia. So they're making the turn out of the back straight very shortly, and it's Hatamat Al Khaladia who's out in front and travelling pretty strongly on the sharp end at the moment. To in second spot, Michal El Katayeb. Then after that, in third, Fala Judah, who's now beginning to struggle as they make the turn and head towards the final 500 metres. Muna is trying to stay on. They're then followed by the green and white colours of Mabubat Jude. But as they start to turn for home now, three quarters of a length is the difference between Hatamat Al Khaladia and a rather tired looking. Michal Al Kateyeb. Staying on though is Muna from the back of the field. She's beginning to make headway and she now moves into third spot. Still trying to stay on is Fala Judah, but it's Hatamat Al Khaladia that leads him down towards the final couple of hundred metres. To in second position, Michal Al Kateyeb. Then after that, down the centre of the track, Muna, who is making progress, but it's only incremental as they go inside the closing stages. And Hatamat Al Khaladia battling on on the far side. Michal Al Kateyeb. Hatamat Al Khaladia could really rather do with the line and it's going to get there though Hatamat Al Khaladir has beaten into second Michal Al Kateyev Mahubat Jude was in third well there we go Hatamat Al Khaladir has scored um, if you were cheering this 